Senna. Pals. So, darling, darling, stand by me. I think, oh, so stand, stand by, by me. me. Oh, oh. Won't you stand? Stand, stand, stand by, by me. me. Something like that. Stand by me. Okay, can you guess what we're watching? As long as you stand by me. You'll be fine. You'll, you'll be fine. You'll, you'll, be, be, fine. you'll okay. be great. Okay, that's what we're watching. <laughs> Hello and welcome back. I'm Steph Sabra, joined by Kristen Stephanopoulos. <laughs> <laughs> Every so time. Good. We're getting better. Stefan Sampino. <laughs> Stefan Sampino. Kristen Stefan Sampino. 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 <laughs> it's so rude. <sighs> it's just rude. We got, the, we got the Steph and the Steph and Sabino. More respect together. for a nice, beautiful Greek last name. More respect for it. Okay. <laughs> so, hello, we're back. And since you're on YouTube, you will be seeing a cut down version of our reaction of Stand By Me. I'm a big Stephen King fan. I haven't seen this one. I'm excited to see this one. Achar has warned us that tears might come into play. So we have our tissue box ready. Get yours ready. And if you've already seen it and you're just here for the ride, great. We love that. If you want to watch the entire movie with us, no cuts or interruptions be- like you will see on this YouTube cut, then you can do that one of two ways either become a patron at patreon.com slash jabby or a member on this youtube channel right here all you'll need is your own copy of the film and i'll give you a three two one countdown you'll put it up in a side by side screen next to us and it's like we're all watching it together which is super fun if you're already a patron or a member thank you we appreciate you before we jump in make sure you hit that subscribe button bell icon all notifications and vote this up okay let's do it i was living in a small town in oregon called castle rock Hey, it's the boss man, Bob Cormier here. It's a beautiful Friday morning in Portland. It's 90 KLAM degrees and getting hotter. What a simple time where kids could just walk and be safe. Right? Best days. <gasps> tweet, 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 rock a robin. A tree house, too. What times? Oh my god, kid. Why are you smoking? Hey. It's different times. How do you know a Frenchman's been in your backyard? I'm French, okay? Oh, Charlie Sheen. Teddy Duchamp was the craziest guy we hung around with. He didn't have much of a chance in life. Oh. His dad was given to fits of rage. Oh. One time he held Teddy's ear to a stove. And oh, oh my God, <gasps> I see it. Before I pile of shit, a pile of shit has a thousand eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what? What's so funny? Come on, I got 30. What have you got? Abusive parents. Mm-hmm. Should it's be thrown why so... in the trash. It's not the secret knock. I forget the secret knock. Let me in. Run. <laughs> Come on, you guys, open up. All kids are very similar. Oh, man. Wait to hear this. Wait to hear this. You won't believe it. It's unbelievable. Let me catch my breath. <laughs> You're so cute. I ran all the way home. Come on, you guys listen to me. This is the same. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, forget I'll it. I'm going to have to tell you enough. Hold on, hold on, you guys, hold on. <laughs> what is it, man? Okay, great. You won't believe this. Sincerely, I ran all the way home. <laughs> Boys are ruthless. Yep. You guys want to go see a dead body? Oh. Well, I was under the porch digging, you know? We all understood what Vern meant right away. <laughs> Everyone's like, now we're listening. Yep. Jesus Christ, Billy, we gotta do something. Why? Who cares? We saw him. So? It ain't nothing to us. The kid's dead, so it ain't nothing to him neither. <gasps> Who gives a shit if they ever... Brocker, or Brower, or Flowers, whatever his name is. This kid is amazing. Big fucking deal. Big deal. We'd all Someone's followed dead. the Ray Brower story very closely because he was a kid our age. Three days before, he had gone out to pick blueberries, and nobody'd seen him since. I think we should tell the cops. I bet you anything that if we find him, we'll get our pictures in the paper. Yeah, yeah, we can even be on TV. <laughs> sure, we'll be heroes. Yeah. I don't know. Billy will know where I found out. He's not going to care. It's going to be us guys that find him, not Billy and Charlie Hogan in a boosted car. They'll probably pin a medal on you, Vern. <laughs> Let's do it. What do you say? All right. Gordy. Sure. Vern? I don't know. Come on, Vern. That summer at home, I had become the invisible boy. Oh. Maybe his family splitting or Mom? having problems? You know what my canteen is? Maybe a kid died in their family oh. or something. It's in Danny's room. Oh. Oh. In April, oh. my older brother Dennis had been killed in a Jeep accident. Jeez. Uh. Four months. <laughs> 
This is your Yankee cat. No, 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 this is your Yankee cat. Oh, he was a good brother. And it looks good on you, too, just like that. Hey, Mo, I'm going blind. Hey, don't start with me, porcupine. Come here, come here. <laughs> Aww. You want to see something? Sure, what? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, man. What is it? Oh, he's wearing a Yankee cap. Come on, what is it? He stole something. It's again. Oh. Wah! Talking, talking, Jesus. Where'd you get this? Copy from my old man's bureau. It's 45. I can see that. Yeah, I guess. Is it loaded? Hell no. What do you think I am? Good. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus! <gasps> oh my. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Forty legit. Jesus. This is not Who's in good. That? Who's letting cherry bombs off out here? Not a cherry bomb. Hey, come on, man. My brother gave me that. And now you're giving it to me. Give oh, it to no. me. They have this cast is loaded. You real asshole. You know that. Ooh. Your brother's not very polite, eyeball. Now, Christopher. No, give him his hat back. Oh! Oh, shit. Take it back. Oh, Come on, man, stop it. You're hurting him, bastard. Let's go, man. Oh, oh no. 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 Oh. Okay, okay, I take it back. I take it back. At least he stopped. Oh, yeah. There. I feel a whole lot better about this. What a dick. How about you? No. Good. Give him his hat yeah, back. His brother passed away. Are you kidding me? And you know it's a small town, so they all know. Oh. Be about 20 miles. Sound about right to you, Gordy? Yeah. Yeah, it might even be 30. Gee, maybe we should just hitchhike. <laughs> we could go out to Route 7 to the show. 20 Shiloh miles. Church, Damn. And down the back car alone. That's not so bad. We'll be there by sundown. Yeah, it'll just be a two-day trip. Yeah. Savage land. It's fast gun for hire. He's <laughs> well, you have to fill up the junkyard. My dad's safe. Well, not if Chopper's there. Chopper's there. We'll see. You ha ha. Very funny. <laughs> Those used to be the best when you just start singing for no reason. Yeah. No trespassing was enforced by Milo Pressman, the junkman, and his dog Chopper, the most feared and least seen dog in Castle Rock. Least seen. Have you guys been watching the Mickey Mouse Club lately? Yeah. I think that's tits are getting bigger. Think so? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think he's right. I've been noticing lately that the A and the E are starting to bend around the side. <laughs> <laughs> this is really a good time. The most a blast. Vern didn't just mean being off limits inside the junkyard or fudging on our folks or going on a hike up the railroad tracks to Harlow. They're so cute. Everything was there and around us. We knew exactly who we were and exactly where we were going. It was grand. Oh, Vern! Hey! Hey, you kid! What are you doing there? Come over here! Let the kid go. I'll sick my dog on you. What? Sick him, sick him, boy. Now Why? he said sick him, boy, but what I heard was chopper sick balls. <laughs> sick balls. <laughs> sick balls. <laughs> I'll make you run. Come <laughs> on, choppy. Sick balls. Oh my Stop god. Stop teasing that dog, you hear me? Stop teasing him! Then don't sick him on me. Oh, Sonny, I'm gonna beat your ass teasing my dog like that. Yeah, like she tried to climb over his fence and get me fat ass. Don't you call me that, oh. you little tin weasel peckerwood loony son. Oh. oh. What did you call me? I know who you are. You're Teddy Duchamp. Your dad's a loony. A loony up in the nut oh, house shit. in Togas. He took your ear and he put it to a stove and he burnt it off. Ugh. Call my dad a loony again, and I'll kill you. Loony, loony, loony. Ah! I'm gonna rip your head off and oh, shut down God. your neck! Wow. I know all you guys, and all your fathers are gonna get a call from me. Oh, shit. You guys know what the next train is, too? We could go down to the Route 136 bridge. What are you, crazy? That's five miles down the river. You walk five miles down the river, you gotta walk five miles back. I'll be waiting for you on the other side. 
Relaxing with my thoughts. <laughs> you use your left hand or your right hand for that? <laughs> you I better start run. running. Dude, I would run so quick across that thing. I was trying to feel if he feels the shape. Run! There's uh, for sure there's a train, sure a train going to come. You don't have time for... Oh, he's checking. Let's see if you can feel it. They're coming. Ah! Train! They're almost there. You guys are almost there, though. Run! Oh, shit! Come on, Vern! Come on, Vern! Oh, my God! Oh, Come on, Vern! Get on, Vern! Run! Oh, my oh, God. Vern, Vern. damn. You're killing me. Oh, my God. He's... Here. Vern! Vern! Come on! Oh, my God, dude. I know these guys see him. There's no way that people in the train can't they see, see him. They see him, but they can't, they can't stop. Slow down. They're like, move. All right, we got two saved. Come on, burn! Ah! Burn! I can't Shut stand Come you on, right now, burn. Push him. <gasps> they went off the ledge. Oh my god, oh. thank god. That was the old time train dodge. Too cool. Vern, you were so scared you looked like that fat guy, Abby Costello, when you saw the mummy. I wasn't that scared. Yes, you were, Vern. <laughs> Nothing like a smoke after a meal. <laughs> yeah. They're just trying to be cool. I cherish these moments. <gasps> I love it. They're way too old for this. I mean, for their age. Hey, Gordo, why don't you tell us a story? Uh, I don't know. Oh, come on. Yeah, come on, Gordo. Aww. Not one of your horror stories, okay? I don't want to hear no horror stories. <laughs> come on, Gordy, it's a small story. <laughs> well, all the kids, instead of calling him Davy, they call him Lardass. Lardass Hogan. Even his little brother and sister call him Lardass. But one day he gets an idea. The greatest revenge idea a kid ever had. Is this thing on? Can you hear me? Now, oh my the gosh. next contestant in the great Tri-County Fight yeah. Principal... These kids are like in it. Right. Boom, baba, boom, baba. Wow. I hate bullies. I do too. Boom, baba, boom, so baba, boom. <laughs> <laughs> Hands behind your backs, gentlemen. Drum roll. Hey, Lardass! Chow down, wide load! Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Um, <laughs> Done. What do they have to... You gotta eat the middle, yeah, all the middle. All the middle, okay. A sound started to build in Lardass' stomach. Don't do it. A strange and scary sound, like a log truck coming at you at 100 yeah. miles an hour. Oh, you see, he's gonna fart. Fart? Vomit? Fart. What's happening? Oh, he's gonna throw up. Throw up on the bullies. Throw up on Maybe the bullies. That's what he's gonna do. Bardess opened his mouth. Oh, no. And before Bill Travis oh. knew it, he was covered with five. <laughs> The women in the audience screamed. Boss man Bob Cormier took one look at Bill Travis and barfed on Principal Wiggins. <laughs> Principal Wiggins barfed on a lumberjack that was sitting next to him. <laughs> Mayor Grundy barfed on his wife's tits. <laughs> but when the Lardass just sat back and enjoyed what he'd created. A complete and total <laughs> barforama. Barforama. <laughs> <laughs> That was the best. Just oh. the best. Oh my god. What happened? What do you mean what happened? That's the end. How can that be the end? What kind of an ending is that? What happened to Lardass? They want no more. Well, um, maybe you went home and celebrated with a couple of cheeseburgers. Aw. Uh. Sounds like a woman screaming. It's not coyotes. It's just ghosts. 
Oh, don't say that. Hey, Teddy, sit down. Oh, they haven't heard wolves. Maybe we should stand guard. Yeah, that's a good idea. Give me the gun. Hell no. Hell no. No offense, kiddo. You're the last one of the group I'd give the gun. 2,300 hours. Corporal Teddy Duchamp stands guard. He would be. I wouldn't give him the gun. He's not stable enough. The dog faces rested easy in the knowledge that Corporal Teddy Duchamp was protecting all that was dear to them. <laughs> I wouldn't give it to him either. Oh my god. <laughs> Just shoot at like a little the air. The wind. I can't with his little outfit. You know, he's too cute. <laughs> you guys need to familiarize yourself with the sounds of animals. Mm. Mm. That's so sad. Should have been you, Gordon. <gasps> no. Are you okay? What a sweet friendship. You're dreaming. Wow. Please don't let it be him who dies at the end. I don't want any of them to die. You think die. somebody's going to die? I didn't cry at Why are you throwing that out there? I don't know. I just get the feeling. Don't say that. I'm going to, like, no. I miss him. I know. Go back to sleep. Chris is such a good friend. Maybe you could go into the college courses with me. That'll be the day. Why not? You're smart enough. You won't let me. What do you mean? It's the way that people think of my family in this town. It's the way they think of me. I'm just one of those low-life chambers kids. Aww. No one even asked me if I took the milk money that time. I just got a three-day vacation. Did you take it? Yeah, I took it. <laughs> maybe I was sorry and I tried to give it back. You tried to give it back? And maybe I took it to old lady Simons and told her, and the money was all there. And maybe the next week, old lady Simons had this brand new sugar on when she came to school. Yeah, yeah, it was brown and had dots on it. Yeah. I stole the milk money, but old lady Simons stole it back from me. Oh my God. Just suppose that I told the story. Me, Chris Chambers, kid brother to eyeball Chambers. Do you think that anyone would have believed it? Oh, oh my gosh. I just wish that I could go someplace where nobody knows me. Oh my god. <laughs> that's that's so oh. wrong. I guess I'm just a pussy. No. Yeah. You're stronger than all of us. Mm -hmm. That's so wrong. So there's little choices that can change people's lives. Mm-hmm. The reality of Ray Brower was growing and kept us moving despite the heat. For me, the idea of seeing that kid's dead body was starting to become an obsession. Mm. Mm. Ace, I gotta tell you something. But you gotta swear in your mother's good name that you won't tell anybody. You got it, pal. No. The eyeballs? Bad news. By noon, Ace and Eyeball had told their secret to everybody in the gang. I guess for those guys, protecting their mother's good name wasn't the top priority. <laughs> he is very hey, you know, it's not that deep. You can walk across. It's gonna dip. Yep. <gasps> oh. Ew, what's you in there? You gotta go a little bit closer. Told you it should have stuck to the tracks. Uh oh. Something's gonna be in here. Is it me, or are you the world's biggest pussy? 
I suppose this is fun for you. Get out of the water. Hey, what do you think you're going, LeChance? Yeah, LeChance. <laughs> Come on, you guys. <laughs> Fire! 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 What's on their arms? No way. Gee, what's on their arms? Are those leeches? No, ew, no. Ew, ew. No, no, it's just, it's just a leaf. <laughs> Vern, there's something on your neck. Yeah, Vern, no, no, I'm, I'm serious, no, Vern. Vern. There is. No, Vern, there is something on your neck. Oh, it's, it's a leaf. leaf. Ew, 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 ew. <laughs> ew, they have to take off all their clothes. <laughs> yep. I hate to say it. <laughs> They're gonna laugh. Oh, no. Oh, he's going to <laughs> I'm Gordy, sorry. Man, are you okay? Oh, I don't mean to laugh. I don't uh, mean to laugh. Like, I just... Gordy, they're, they're poor tiny oh. whitey. Maybe he's dead. He's not dead. He's still breathing, you idiot. Well, I don't know. Hey, hey, hey. Just cool, you guys. Just fainted. Gordy? You kind of look like Alfalfa a little bit right there. Let's go back. Oh, <laughs> what a surprise! The king of the pussies wants to go back too. Stop calling me that. What pussy? Stop it! Pussy! Stop! Punches. Pussy! 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 You pussy! Four-eyed psycho! Oh. Four-eyed psycho! Come you on, like man. it? Too much punching! Too much punching! Like it, Teddy? Too much! Break it up! Break it up! Stop it! Oh, Teddy! Oh, Teddy! 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 Teddy
but neither our gang nor their gang got the credit. In the end, we decided that an anonymous phone call was the best thing to do. That's huge. Mm -hmm. Growth. We headed home, and although many thoughts raced through our minds, we barely spoke. Damn, yeah, that's heavy. Yeah. We'd only been gone two days, but somehow the town seemed different, smaller. Mm -hmm. As time went on, we saw less and less of Teddy and Vern, until eventually they became just two more faces in the halls. Damn. Wow. We'll see ya. Not if I see you first. No. Oh. Mm, you guys, please stay friends forever, please. Chris did get out. He enrolled in the college courses with me. Oh. He went on to college and eventually became a lawyer. Yay! Wow. Last week, he entered a fast food restaurant. Just ahead of him, two men got into an argument. Oh, no. One of them pulled a knife. No. He was stabbed in the throat. He died almost instantly. Oh. But he became a lawyer. Yeah. Oh, that's so sad. He came around. He got out. Oh, sh Oh, like the ones I mm. had on that list. Well, because that, that type of friendship is what I feel like I talk, I, I try to talk about a lot. It's never the same as what you once had, mm. you know? Yeah, there's... That childhood friendship, it's a pureness. It's like you go to that playground, you're like, hi, right. I'm Kristen, what's yes. your name? I'm Steph. Do you wanna be friends? Yeah. Do you wanna play? Yeah. And there's no judging, it's automatic. No like, judgment. You jump right into the game, you play, you know what right. I mean? Right. Yeah, Ugh. this was, Film this excellence. Is, this is a beautiful film. What a great contained story in 90 minutes. Yeah. But I agree, like, there's something so special about being a kid where you can be like, shut up. And yeah. then, like, two seconds later, you're, 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 you're still good. Give me skin. Yeah. But now it's like, if someone says shut she said shut up. I'm never talking to her again. Well, here's the thing. I think with age comes bitterness. Mm. With age comes anger. It comes hurt, pain, right? When you're young, the innocence of it, it's like you believe in forgiveness, you believe in the hope, you believe in miracles. You, There's so much that you Forever put, throw to the side, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I feel like you. the only thing that really matters is, are we having a good time? Do right. I like you? Yes. And you know what? Okay, I messed up too. I'm sorry. It's okay. Thank you. Can we be friends again? Yeah. And then you're like, yeah, and you hop into this play. And when you get older, we're so bitter and we have so much anger and like issues that we hold on to those grudges, you know yeah. what I mean? So that's what, you know what I mean? Yes, like, totally. My it, sister um, birthed my beautiful nephew, To, my nephew, and he's now in daycare and she's like so enamored with the way they interact. Mm -hmm. Every it's day beautiful. it's a new group of friends. So like one day he'll be best friends with one kid, the next day he'll be the another kid, and then the next day he'll be both of the kids and all in a group. And, and it's it like they don't remember or hold on to things. No. It's just like, Anyone, no matter what you look like, you're just friends with. Yeah, because there's no, there's nothing that was tainted. Right. And the older we get, the more things become tainted, more jaded we become. And it's kind of sad because a lot of us, instead of having those hard conversations that, you know, we, we start getting our ego and our pride mixed into it as well. And we're like, oh, well, huh. Huh. Wait, I totally messed so. this up. Who did I say that was? That was Corey Feldman, who played Teddy. Okay, yeah, I totally messed that up. I said, um, I forget his name now, but my bad. The cast is incredible. I mean, these Beautiful. kid actors, I can't believe they can portray such emotions as children. Yeah. What a cast. But yeah, it's like such a great story. It's never about the destination. It's the journey. Yeah, and, no, and it was very home. Yeah. Like, you just felt like a home and took you back to your childhood. Yeah. And it gives you that feel good. Right. But also a bit, little bit of sadness because you're like, man, what I would give to have those moments again. Right. And there's you so know? much to extrapolate just from, like, 
kids yeah. wearing the bait of the the weight of their mm-hmm. parents yeah. and then kind of like how social classes work and how yeah. hard it is to mobilize but I'm glad at the end he was able to mobilize yeah. and make it up and just having good friends in your life is so important it is and coming up this is such a good coming of age and like so good. it's it's crazy cuz as children we are they are wise Children are actually very wise, but also sometimes they're smarter and we can like than us. Yeah. And it comes from that innocence. Right. So it's like sometimes like we can learn a lot from children. Uh, just as much as children can le- learn from us, there's a different type of lesson that is it's learned yeah. through them, you know? But, yeah. Oh, yeah. I said Charlie Sheen. It's Corey Feldman, but yeah, they kind of look alike. But yeah, I should have known that. He's Corey Feldman, such a famous kid actor. And then that was Ke- Kiefer Sutherland, which obviously rocks. I just saw him in Lost Boys. But anyways, that was an incredible film. Stephen yep. King is such an excellent writer, but Rob Reiner did such a great job directing that, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Great soundtrack. Thank you guys. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon, all notifications, and vote this up. I'm Steph Sabra. This is Kristen Savas Much love. Bye.